the 13th of November. There's a few little changes here and there, and I'm also going to share with you what I'm up to. So what I'll do, I'll turn you round. So if you know here, there was a massive double bed where a lot of the stuff I had on um, for eBay and stuff I was working through was on the bed. That's now gone, um, went earlier on via van because a lady we know is moving house, wanted a bed, gave a good price, bish bash bosh, done, and it's gone. So it'll be another five weeks before we get like a single bed in here. Just a single. So in the meantime, I can get the boxes out that I need to get out for the SKU codes and check if they're in there or on eBay or missing or whatever. That can be done. Then I can put a few bits and pieces here um, until the bed arrives because we're going to get it next week anyway. So I can work through some bits, get some stuff listed because it is quite a squeeze to do that here anyway. Oh, and also I noticed the sods when I got it, um, this noticed the other day that the batch numbers on these um, rolls of wallpaper are AO642 um, and then three of them are, this one should be the AO7. So what I've done is I listed two at AO6 and three at AO7. So same reference number but that's kind of annoying. Oh well, never mind. I can't be helped but it's kind of annoying. Even though I got that a lot for free. What I'll do now though is sort out some stuff. I've got to come in here, like a chair and all the rest of that stuff, and then go outside and got a lot of to put away. I'll speak to a bit. We've got this chair here that's gonna go in the that room, the PC room, what you call it. And then I've got this slot here, um, Cypress maps, and I have more Cypress maps and stuff in South the country. I did the whole lot as one listing, which I didn't need to do. I should have just um, done it as a separate listings for these two, and then that one, and, and those, like Kelder Water and the County Red Book, Hertfordshire. So those are going, a lot of rubbish maps, no one needs them really. That, to go with these two, um, put away. And then I've got all, all these that I brought out of the, um, that infamous <laughs> indoor car boot thing, all these bits. Uh, hammers, West Ham mags will go away, and same with the um, Nancy Drew stuff. That's that lot. So this lot on here has got to be put away, and same with these. Some of these have been out for a long time, need to be put away. Monopolies, got some of these bits here, put away. That doesn't work, but probably most has gone in it, which is annoying. But I got it at the, one of the last jumble trails I went to. Chinese bowl got for free, and then obviously these, um, CSIs and games and stuff. And then I've got some Warhammer um, books I got out of the Pearly charity shop, Emmaus. So some of these have been sat around for ages because obviously in that room um, with the big bed that used to be in there, um, it's quite difficult to sort out and put and whatever else. But now it's the time to get stuff sorted out, put away, and then get some stuff sorted out, listed, and whatever else. Because obviously when you... Um, get another bed, it'll take like, four or five weeks to come anyway, so you've got plenty, I've got plenty of time to sort it out, so um, I'll share with you in a sec when I'm outside, um, what I'm putting away, where I'm putting it, SKU codes, all the rest of the stuff, so it's been a bit. So what have we got? We've got this Ravensburger puzzle, the CSI and Monopoly, they go in the shed, not the big shed, but the shed just outside you've seen before, um, that'll go separate bag, and in a bag on top, they go in bags, like big white bags to protect them anyway, and then folded over and um, tied and stuff like that. So they'll be put away. So it gives me a chance to work through some of this throughout um, probably a little bit tomorrow, week, uh, next week, and that. that. This is only a little bit of what I've got anyway. Got more stuff to sort out. So we're out here in the garden. Not that cold really. It's 20 past 12. Nice little Saturday afternoon. <laughs> so the things that I'm going to put um, in this shed will be going on here. One dog will go in the boxes because we moved the table over here to put away for winter. Because we don't keep the table out in the winter. We wrap it up and put it away because 
it's only a plastic type table so if it's really half winter it gets cracked a lot but yeah the garden's here and what more can you say about the garden really they've got the new lights some new light mum put some new um lights i don't know what to call them but nice lights when they light up um during the night i might be able to come out later and show you the lights but they're quite nice when they lit up for the night time they just show off the arbor a lot more the archway so gonna get the items out now get the boxes out and put them away and put the SKU codes on the items and where they're going to go so I recently took out some items that sold when I did the old legendary George Ross thing of ending listings and changing titles all the rest of that and selling similar <laughs> sold a few things on that which I shared with you on my Wednesday live last Wednesday the 12th, 10th it was This one is going under this table in a bag and then these get wrapped up, put in the big shed. Uh, I believe these, yeah, will go in the smaller shed. Same with these ones. Um, probably put these in a bag. And then obviously these will go in a um, box and that sort of thing. So, yeah, it's always trying to work out space, um, what space you can have and we put stuff out, put stuff in. It's, it can be quite a painful thing, but it's all right. Get used to it. We had a good time to put stuff away at last. Hee, <laughs> boom. So the dishes for the Chinese dishes gone in there. Ball games in there. That lot been put away. A few bits have been put away inside. So yeah, just this lot to be put away in that shed and boom. Right, time to get boxes out and put stuff away. At last, <laughs> it took me so long to get his box sorted out, put stuff inside it, like for example, the West Ham magazines and the two guides. So basically, you've got to try and get it in as much as you can, compact it all in with the lid that goes on. So you can see it goes on without hitting anything at the back. You can see that through there. So you've got a little bit of space up the top. But if things like in here don't fit, then you've got to put it in another box, another SKU code. So it swings around about, but try and make as much space as you can where you can with your 
storage facilities. have a think. These and this roll dial and it's Nancy Drew, we've got to go inside because 90% of my storage area is full. I say that because where I've got some of the stuff in the boxes, um, basically they won't go in other boxes with the shape of things. There's only room for a small little bit, not something as, well it's not that big but you know what I mean, like that. So, yeah. Anyway, let me just grab the camera. These two book box sets got to go inside. They won't fit in the, any of the boxes or in the shed, which is a shame. Because my storage area in the shed is about 95% full. So these got to go inside. I'll sort them out tomorrow where they're going to go. Oh, so basically I'm pretty much done here. As I say, 95% full here. So hopefully some of this stuff will get sold before New Year and then even before the car boots start, realistically in March. So like, I've got bags full of board games and stuff and toys. Boxes full of stuff, all marked up. So I know which one it is, put on the SKU codes. It's the worst box, not this one down here. No, nope. with stuff on it. It's this one here, you've got to lift it up, out, up, over here, out again, and then all the way around, and then down. Oh, it's the right palaver, but yeah, hopefully some of this stuff will sell. If you do like some of this stuff, then let me know in the comments below. Or, alternatively, check out the description below. eBay stores there. Buy something from a store. Or go to Instagram, Facebook, send me a message, and we get a deal going. So that's basically all I've had to do today. This afternoon, because it's 25 past 1, guys, for lunch. And I'm going to play some games on my PlayStation 4. Boom. Going to chillax all afternoon. No more eBay, just relaxing, playing games, and... Come out here early evening to show you the lights by the arbor. Mum put these lights up way over a month and a half ago when we cut back the big um, bushy planty thing that mum put in years and years and years ago. It overgrew. You can't really sit from here, but it was over here. It grew all the way up the arbor, all the way down. Oh, it took about four or five days to get rid of it. Mum took it to about halfway, and then we decided to get rid of the whole shebang, the whole lot, and put these lights up. So Mum put these lights up, and they look pretty nice. So the lights get brighter, more sun, and then less bright when there's no sun about, but it's quite a nice um, feature in the guard. Cheers, everyone watching this video if you've got any comments stick them down below the comment section i've got instagram facebook and a ko-fi page where you can buy me a coffee support channel all you have to say is like share and subscribe catch you later take care see ya